Good evening and welcome back once again. So this week we're playing Panathinaikos. If you caught the video last time, we had our first cup game of the season against Galatasaray. We comfortably winning 2-0 and we let in a goal in the last minute. So all to play for in the second leg. Going to see that in uh, probably a couple of weeks time. Let's just jump into the uh, team selection and see who we've got for this week. So this week, a bit more familiar looking lineup. Well, I've got Trippier coming in at right back in place of Dest, just because he's on good condition, and I think he deserves a bit of a run out. We've also got Bellingham coming in on the left in place of St. Maximum. I'm sure he'll get some time off the bench. Um, but other than that, sort of regular looking lineup. And here we go. So, you know what's good about this this Division One, our first season in Division One is um, playing teams obviously that I haven't played before. So it's interesting to see. You, you, sometimes you're not really sure what you're going to come up against, how good they're going to be. That just goes out there. Like Galatasaray in the last match ended up only winning two one, but. They're second in the league, and I know it was a cup game, but I thought they were quite disappointing. Um, but in the end, we only won by one goal, so... He's like, just loses out there. Bellingham. Bellingham just loses out somehow. It seems to just hit the back of the defender's head. I'm not sure what's happening there. Yeah, with the afterburners. Oh, and he's like just, again, the players aren't where they're supposed to be. They never seem to do that. They never seem to run into that six yard box. Bit of a strange one. Isaac. Oh, well over. Some good touches though. Finish was pretty terrible. That's a terrible tackle. Yeah, definitely a yellow card. Oof. Nowhere near the ball. Nice ball in. Not sure how the ball ended up there. That, that wasn't the house header, was it? Either way, we've got to throw in now. Isaac's got to get in there. That was a good ball. Well, not what you would say really a clear cut chance yet. Had that Isaac shot earlier, but that's about it so far. Show you that was too. Good block there from Guardiol. Oh, okay. I thought it was a block. And that's a terrible pass, giving it away in a really dangerous position. Get the ball back in the end, but that was um, playing a bit too risky. Isaac loses out though. Need to be stronger there. Good tackle from Rice. Bit of a scrappy game so far, must say.
Nice head of out. Again, why have I just passed it straight to them? Not getting the bounces though. Sometimes you get that where it just doesn't matter what you do, you just don't get the ball back from those little deflections and blocks and tackles. Look at that, it's just gone straight back to there. Just a white shirt every single time. Don't know if it's scripted or what, but I don't know what an Isaac's <laughs> in his own six yard box. Terrible, terrible pass. We need to get a hold of this ball, just play it a little bit more simply. There we go, that's better. And a heavy touch from Isaac. It's not been good. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Oh, you've got to laugh, but that poor keeper. Probably the best move we've done, actually. Really nice ball out wide. Lovely ball in. Thought I'd hit a pretty good ball, but it's straight at the keeper. And, yeah. He won't want to see that again, that's for sure. But we haven't been very good in this half at all. There we go. Yep, I wouldn't say we deserve to be leading in that half. I really don't. But um, I'll take it and we'll jump back into the second half, hopefully for a better performance. I think Plymouth and Lagos will feel a little bit hard done by in that... Uh, that first half. Isaac could be in here. Has he got the strength? He hasn't really got anyone around him. He's held it up well. Bruno! Good take from the keeper. That time. He will be having nightmares after that goal in the first half. That was a terrible ball. Passing has been pretty atrocious. And the worst we there uh, passed the ball. Lovely ball through there though, and that's a terrible finish from Isaac. He's had a shocker of a game. I know he's technically got that goal, but um Yeah, it just it's been pretty bad. Oh, gives the ball away again. Lovely ball to Yaldo, it should have gone in, should have gone in there. Should have scored. And somehow they went it back on the, uh, well, within the six yard box. And he actually scores a second, that's amazing. He's had a terrible game, but you know what? He's got his name twice on the score sheet. And that was a spectacular finish. He just blasted it in. Nice little one too. Bruno with the assist. Smashes it in there. 
Maybe me saying it was a spectacular assist was over it a little bit, but we'll make some changes. Okay, so I'm going to bring on two new wing backs in, Lewis and Dest, and Brian Hill is going to come in the place of Isaac. I just think he hasn't had a good game, scored two goals, so we've got what we need from him. And Admon can go up top again, and we'll see what that uh, see how that goes. You know, Brian Hill and Amon really linked up well in the last match, so got that same combo again now. Obviously, not as much time to to get in or anything, but I'm not sure what happened with Armon there. He seemed to do a fake shot for some reason. I wasn't trying to do that. Don't even know what to say about that. Terrible defending. Didn't put in a tackle. To be fair, they, I think they deserve it. I think they deserve a goal. Got a tackle. There's two people on them. And yeah, that's just... That nice finish. Yep, yeah, I would say they deserve at least one goal. Especially the performance we put in the first half. Can we put a good cross in though? Well, we do. And there should be another corner. That's not a good corner at all. Did it? I don't think it beat the first man there, did it? Bellingham, ah, oh, straight at the keep there. I've said it before though, sometimes you just got to hit the target and if, if the keeper saves it, then fine, but it's certainly the most important thing. Yeah, oh, should have been three. Lovely weight of shot. Oh, just didn't quite curl enough. Good effort though. It's one of those where I think I did everything right and it's just, uh, you know, obviously there is a little bit of RNG with player stats and things like that. So, you know, maybe in that exact same position, maybe six or seven times that would be on target. Um, Six or seven times out of ten, I meant there. Um, somewhere around that. Don't let them in though. Remember, this is 2 1. Lovely one from Bellingham. But again, he's lacking support. And that. Gotta give him support. Then all the hard work, there should be someone there right in it. There was, but just as it was too late. Oh, terrible tackle there. Ah, oh, he's not injured, is he? Let's hope he's not. He did give it away just before that. Lovely ball through to Hill. There it is. Game safe now. Really nicely worked. Brian Hill with a goal. He's been, been playing really well recently. Uh, really impressed with him. But again, it's, it's him and Almond linking up. He just pauses and run, checks back, and around the keeper. Yeah, I've got a good thing going on there with Almiron and, and Brian Hill. Now, obviously, we don't generally play Almiron up top. Um, but the times we have and we've played Hill on the left, it's, it's worked very, very well. So, we've got a bit of a... Well, not even a plan B, probably a plan C or D, but... And, yeah, I don't know what that 
was. That should be it. And it is. Three points again. Cut it a little bit closer than it should have been. Had a really disappointing first half, but, you know, in the end we've got the three points, three goals. Again, our goal scoring streak will not stop. And just looking at the ratings, Isaac got an eight, which is quite frankly ridiculous. I didn't think he was very good at all. The second goal, great finish, but he lost the ball a number of times. Um, maybe that's me being a little bit harsh, but an eight? No, he didn't save that, but I'll take it. Another three points on the board. And if we have a look at the table, we're actually three points ahead of Galatasaray now. They must have got a draw in the last match. And in the goal and assist, even though I didn't think Isaac played that well, he's now back ahead of Liao in the goal scoring charts, which is great. Good news for us, having the top two there. And Isaac and Liao still the top two in assists as well. But that'll do it for this week, so thank you very much for joining once again. Please like if you can, leave a comment down below. But I'll see you next time, and thank you once again.